Has she's perfect, she won't be able to hurt a fly. <laughs> What in the world is wrong with you? I am sorry, I didn't mean. After eating him out of there. That's right. Keep running. I don't want to see your disgusting face again. I still don't understand why guys keep coming at me. Just because I'm tiny doesn't mean I can't fight. Hi, my name is Mia. Yes, I know how to fight. And no, I'm not homeless. I used to be, but my aunt took me in when I was very little. I lost my mother and father when I was very young, but I promised to help my aunt no matter what. I promised to work and get us a nice house. Andy, I'm home. You're finally home, I missed you. Of course, I love my auntie, but I also miss my parents. How was your day today? It was good. You beat another guy up, didn't you? Maybe. Well, sweetie, you should go to sleep. You have school tomorrow, remember? All right. Eek bedtime. The next day. Rise and shine. You're going to be able to be late for school. Mumbles. Five more minutes. Your waffles will get burnt if you don't get up on time. W wait. I'm up. Please don't burn them. Ugh. She always uses the same trick. Oh yeah. What time is it? H, how is it 8 p.m. already? You got up right on time. I'm almost done with your coup. I can't talk right now. I'm super late. It's only 7 a.m. though. Uh, I'm going to be so late. I can't believe that I forgot my girlfriend lunch. Watch where you're going, pink head. That why we have eyes. Wow. How rude, and here I was going to say thanks. He should consider himself lucky to have bumped into a cute pink head. How that? Mr. Watch where you're going? Great, my day is ruined now by some Barbie doll. School bell. I'm going to be late. And this is my best friend Grace. Ugh, where is that girl? I am here. Do you not realize how late you are? Ugh, come on. Let's go. That hurt. You need to stop pulling me from my wrists. Why do you have to be such a big baby? I didn't even touch you. Maybe you shouldn't have came late. And then this wouldn't have happened. Oh, I'm sorry, big baby. Come here and hug mommy. No thanks. Did she just? Stop being like that and come. So, are you going to give me a hug or no? Fine. They're so childish. I'm embarrassed to go to the same school as them. Babe! Ugh. That girl doesn't deserve to be anywhere near nor with my brother. What's wrong, Grace? It's nothing. Stop lying. I can see when you're telling the truth and when you're not. You're obviously lying right now. Ha, we have to go to class, remember? After class. I can't believe that. Ah, uh, S stop. What's going on? Damn, Alpha, I never knew that you'd own a girly bag like this. I never thought that you were like this. Maybe I should tell everyone that their Alpha owns a purple bag. Or I should I do that right after I finish tearing this dumb bag apart? Don't you dare touch it. It'll be the one to rip you apart if I see a scratch on it. Did I give you permission to raise your voice? That bag isn't even mine. It's a gift for my girlfriend. Chill, I was just teasing you. Let's see if that girlfriend or yours will still like you once I tear that pretty smirk off your face then. Get out of my way, Pinkie Pie. Hand over that bag first. What makes you think that it'll listen to a short kid like you? You don't scare me at all. You want to be Powerpuff Girl. We'll see about that. You should never underestimate me, ever. Are you going to return my dear Alpha's bag now? Muffled speaking. Speak. All right, fine. Take your stupid bag. What are you waiting for? Scram. You're a monster. Girls shouldn't even act like that. Tell me something that I don't know. Whoa, uh, you're the guy from this morning. Whatever, just hand over the bag. Jeez, the least that you could do is thank me. Thanking a Barbie doll is more shameful than anything else that I've seen. 
I didn't even want to help you. I should be just left you to get beat up. Chi Chi, what a brat. Mia! I thought that we were going to meet outside of class. You made me look everywhere for you. So, are you okay? It's nothing. We have class, remember? I'm sorry. I didn't think that you'd be mad because of that. What was even going on earlier? Well, Og, it's my mom. Mom, I'm busy talking with my friend now. Just call her. <laughs> All right, he'll come home right now. Tell our butler to come and pick me up, though. Who did Grace get in trouble? Nope. Apparently, my brother needs a bodyguard. He got beat up and went to the principal's office and asked them for a bodyguard, so they ended up calling my mom and telling her about it. You have a brother? And you didn't tell me? You never asked, though. I just realized something. What is it? Why can't you be my brother's bodyguard? I mean, you're crazy strong and can defeat eight men in less than a minute. No way. I don't even know him. Doesn't mean that you can get to know him. I can introduce you to him. I bet you that you'll get friendly with each other in less than a minute. Still a no. You don't have a choice here. 20 minutes later. Your house is so big. I don't fit in. I'm not rich. Stop complaining. You're not going to change my mind. Your place looks super pretty and big. I've got 300 other houses that are even bigger and prettier than this. Wow, she's richer than I expected. Mom, I'm home and I brought over a guest. Honey, you're home. Oh, oh, oh and you came with a lonely guest. Oh, you're so pretty and cutie. I'm so sorry, I shouldn't have scared you like that. It's all right, I was just taken back. She has such glowing eyes. I've never seen anything like them before. Anyways, sweetie, why did you bring over this lonely lady? First of all, she's my best friend. Second of all, what? She would be perfect for that job. What job? Oh, that job. Yup, that job. <coughs> no offense, but she's so tiny, not to mention girly too. There's no way that someone like her could be my son's bodyguard. Chi Chi, she's just like everyone that I've met, always assuming stuff instead of actually accepting that any girl can fight. Mom, trust me when I say that she can kick butt. I don't really mind being your son's bodyguard. Yeah, no, I still don't believe you. Prove to me that you're not lying. In their gym room. Go ahead, show me that you can actually fight. Really? Why this? I'm so sorry. I went all evil on your expensive robot. You're perfect. Way more than any of the professional fighters that I've seen. W what? I shouldn't have doubted you. If you want you can get right to work tomorrow. Uh, Alright. Thank you very much. I was so excited that night. To the point that I wasn't expecting what was coming next. Andy, I got a job. Auntie, who did this to you? There were some men who came and took all our money. They were stronger than me so I couldn't fight them off. Auntie, let me fix you up. It'll make you forget about what those bad guys did. A few minutes later. Thank you, sweetie. It's nothing. Now let me go and find who did this to you. <laughs> Why are you crying? Those men are dangerous and I, I don't want you to get hurt. You always get in trouble especially when you're trying to protect me. Auntie, look at me. I promise you that once I find those men I'll come home without a scratch. I'm not going to get hurt, alright? I promise that I'll be back safe and sound. Hug? I'll show those guys that they shouldn't mess with my auntie. I'll even get your money back. But when I left, I couldn't find anything. Until, leave him alone. Put me down, you monster. With pleasure. Oh yeah, I forgot about this dude. He looks rich. Wonder why a rich kid like him is being tied down. Sorry I forgot about you. Here, let me untie you. There you go. Can you take off my blindfold? Oh, sure. Thanks. <laughs> she she looks, looks familiar. familiar. Well, anyways, I have to go. Have a good night's rest. I thought that you left to get back at those guys. What are you blushing though? I'm not blushing. Uh, 
God, why am I blushing? Whatever, I have to sleep. I have to get up super early tomorrow. I better not dream about him. Oh yeah, and I have to be someone's bodyguard tomorrow. In the middle of the night. Oh my God, you are sleepy. Go to bed right now, young lady. I'll just wait here. I guess that I'll just wait here. I should go to sleep. After all, it's 5 o'clock a.m. I'm tired. 45 minutes later. It's the guest that mom told me about. She's cold. I hope that no one saw that. She looks so familiar. Oh well, I'll find out in the morning. In the morning. Wake up, sleepy head. Need any help down there? No thanks. Ugh, I hate you. Why does this always happen to me? What's wrong? W what in the world am I wearing? What? It's only a shirt. Why do you keep staring at it? That's my brother's shirt. Here. But he put it on you. I don't care. Just take it. Anyways, my mom is waiting for us in the kitchen. You can meet him there. You can thank him for the shirt once we go. Welcome back, sweetheart. Wait. What's your name? You can call me Mia. Ahem, um, anyways, mom, where's the introduction? Right. I completely forgot about that. Anyways, this is my son. Come on out, honey. I already told you to not call me honey, mom. I'm embarrassing. I'm not a kid any. Oh, yeah. You're that rude guy that bumped into me on my way to school. I even saved you twice and didn't get a thank you. So, that's how I remember her. And also, don't be rude to your mom. That's just disrespectful. Ha, huh, and who are you to tell me that? Your bodyguard. What's so funny? You don't see me laughing, so why are you laughing? Hey, is she actually my bodyguard, mom? Yes, she is. What's wrong with that? Tons of things, actually. Just her being a girl makes me not believe that she's going to be my bodyguard. Not to mention that she's short. How's a dumb shorty supposed to protect me? First of all, I hate to deny it, but you're cute. Don't forget that you're a brat too. And three, just because I'm short, doesn't mean that I can't beat you up easily. Oi, personal space. You're way too close. And I'm not afraid to get closer. Also, I don't care if you don't want me to be your bodyguard. Since I'll start protecting you from now, whether you like it or not. Go and grab your stuff, or else you might be late to school. At school. Sue. What you're telling me is that oh you want me to go with the other girls. Unfortunately. Plus, don't tell me that you forgot that I have keep my eyes on your brother, who is now gone. Alright. Alright. You go with the girls and I'm going to go and get your brother. Hey, I bet you $3,000 that they're going to get together. I looked for him everywhere, but I couldn't find him. Until, finally, I found you. Huh. It is him but. We're over Reven. I can't believe you did this. Trusted you, but why would you do this to me? I don't know what you're talking about. You want to fight, or something. You might be the school's mister, alpha boy, but you're pretty weak considering that you get bullied. Too bad all of your leftover strength is going to go away. Don't you dare touch him. And who might you be? She's my bodyguard. Let's just go Jake. That wasn't the only time that Blake the guy that Jake's girlfriend cheated on him with kept annoying bullying Jake. He kept hitting on me, but me and Jake made him even more pissed by acting like a real couple. It went a bit too far though since. We actually ended up dating. Five months later. Is he still following us? Nope, he never was. I just used him as an excuse to get closer to you. I hate you. Yeah, right. We all know that you think the opposite. What the hell? Ugh. I'll check it out. My shift is over anyways. Whoa. I feel like I'm being watched by someone. Oh. Hi. Who are you? And what do you want? I'm Jaden. Please teach me your amazing ways. How did you do that? Idiot. It's not magic, it's an ability, I'm a vampire. A vampire? Oh my gosh. What's your name? Uh, Lucas, why? Well, can we be friends, Lucas? I'll take those, and I'll give you something in return. 
Come back, my glasses. I'm the boy in the bubble, but then came trouble, and my heart was pumping, chest was screaming, mind was running, air was freezing, put my hands up, put my hands up, I told this kid I'm ready for a fight, punch my face, do it, cause I like the pain, every time you curse my name, I know you want the satisfaction, it's not gonna happen. Oh, why are you here? You come back for your glasses? Why yeah, I want it back. I'm half blind you. Whoa, what's the problem? I felt so weird when I looked at her. Do I need a doctor? No silly, it's love. And love makes you feel and do all different kinds of amazing things. Yeah, dude, you're in love. Love. Hmm? Love. B, but I don't want to love. Listen, don't do that. It's hella creepy. Let's go. Hey, can I borrow some of your blood? Why? You're joking, right? Or not? Come on, just a little. Hey, see, cut it out. You're scaring me. Huh, gotcha. Why would I do that to you if you didn't want it? S, shut up. I was in the moment. Bah ha 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 ha. In the moment, yeah, right. Pfft. You're so clumsy, dude. But seriously, I'm pretty hungry. I'll give you blood when you get me home. Well, pay up, boy. Um, drink my blood? Duh. W what? Are you serious? Er, yeah. Why would I joke about something like that? D dude, I don't want to hurt you. J just shut up and drink up. I'm going back to sleep. You can stay if you want. Tomorrow. Get up. D don't ever do that again. Sue, you got any plans today? Well, nothing comes to mind. No. Great. Get up and let's go somewhere. W why'd you leave me back there? L let's go inside and eat. Okay. Dude, if you like her, just talk to her. Man up. And maybe later. Let's just go eat. Er, don't you find it weird that we're both boys at a restaurant together? Well, it's not like we're dating or anything. Wow, surprising nobody noticed your horns yet. As so, when do we order food? Don't worry, I ordered food. I wonder why you're eating like that. Well, why are you watching me eat, huh? Well, why were you watching me play music? You sounded good, so I wanted to watch. Aw, oh, thank you. Hey, can I show you something? Sure, what is it? My human form. All right, sure. OMG, you look sick. Re-rigged. Where'd you get that scar? I got punched for helping some girl. Hey, let me go. W-H-A-T, the hell are you? I'm going to Starbucks. Welp, see you again. Two hours later. Find a way. Stalker? No, I'm a gentleman. Okay. Okay. I, I don't like rain. Stalker, I'll scream right away. Hey, uh, are you okay? Kyalea, please save me from Da Storm. Stop messing around. It's just a storm, and it's a common weather. Chill out, Jay. Don't worry, I'll protect you. I promise. I'll have to leave without him knowing. I, I'm gonna go grab a blanket. I said I'd protect you, didn't I? Hey, what are you doing here? I'm literally here all the time. We're going somewhere. Or, do you want me to change you? W what do you mean? Erm, with my powers? Yeah, sure. I mean, I'm a boy EI. Okay, you still look fine in it.
Oh shit. Sorry. I got distracted a bit. Come on. Let's go. Haha. -ha. Thank you. Uh uh. It's it's no pee problem. Soa, uh, what's your name? My name is Hannah. I'm Lucas. Well, me and my friend have somewhere to be. But I mean, I can stay here all day if you. Bye, Hannah. Bye, Luca Kun. She's so cute. Yeah, I helped you out. Shut up. Wait here. Why? Few minutes later. Come on, let's go. Are you all right? This place is awesome. Look at all these pillars and those boulders. Who even made this? Lucas, you said you wouldn't. Still don't trust me, huh? Are you friggin' kidding me? I mean, I can lick you again if you want. We're about to enter a different world. What? What kind of? Are you still angry? Yes. Why you do this to me? Don't worry, I'll make it up you. Oh my gosh, Luca Kun, you said I could dye your hair when you got back. Actually, I changed my mind about that. Nonsense, come on, we gotta go to that party after. Let's go, my friend. I'll come back for you, Jay. Sue, I'm Jaden. I'm Kagamine. Wanna go over to the party over there? Heck yeah. Wait, I have nothing to wear. I can lend you some of mine. You will have to wear horns. Human aren't allowed. You look great. Come on, let's go. Why did you do that? Few minutes later. Let's just say this is how I make it up to you. Wait. And I'm leaving the day after tomorrow. Hey, Jay. Yeah? What is it? Tomorrow. Can we act like it's the end of the world and go to a lot of places? Pfft. Don't we do that every day? Sure. Wanna go back? Yeah. I'm kinda hungry. You idiot. Hey, guys. I'm glad you came over and stopped touching my ears. What? Why are you staring like that? Ah, about to hold hands, I see. Oh, uh, me and Jay here have to get back to the reality. Come on, Jay. Bye, you lovebirds, and make sure to come back soon. Bye. So where were we? You should go to sleep. Two hours later. Whoa, uh, since when do you wear sleeping masks? Mind your own business. Aw, oh, don't give me that. I was just asking. Well, at least I'm not wearing my clothes that I'm gonna wear tomorrow. Well, I don't sleep. Yeah, right. Whatever. Tomorrow. Ah, stop scaring me. I'll miss this guy the most. Come on, let's go. I don't need anything else except you. That's who I am, selfish and stubborn. As long as we are together, we can get through anything. And I love you. I'm always worried since we met. Even if we separated just a bit, I'm sad. Very sad. To the point that I can't hold in my tears. It's just so coincidental that we both are calling each other unknowingly. It's like telepathy between us. Our first kiss was embarrassing. But I'd wish that time would stop. Hmm. Oh, well. If wishes were real, I'll rewind time back to that moment. I don't need anything else except you. That's who I am. Selfish and stubborn. H. Hot. What was that? Nothing. Nothing. As long as we are together, we can get through anything. And I love you. That was epic. I'm gonna go change. I'll miss you. Poke. Do you have anything to say? I don't know. Do you? I really like you. 
You uh, do you mean as friends? I mean, if you like someone, it's just like. But if you're crushing on a person, it's like like. Which one? I like like you. So he's bisexual, but why love someone like me? Lucas, please wait for me. I have to go back to the other world forever. B, but what? What about me? I hate you. I hate you so much because you made me fall in love with you too. Shut up. Why didn't you just tell me? I would have understood. Shut up. Why do I have to? You should. I said shut up. Son, why have you summoned me? Uh, Dad, aren't we leaving today? Huh? You know like to the other world with Yosei and Kagamine. That's not till next month? Is that your friend? He's my boyfriend. I suppose I can make an exception to let him come along with us then. I'm Sector. Hello, sir. My name is Jaden. When him and I had our first date, he accidentally made the table fall over. What about you, cutie? I don't wanna talk about it. I'll let you go, cause I love you. I love you too. Oh wow. Guys, what if we let Lucas play his guitar in the house? Sure, I can do that. 